Warata, Tilopia speciosissima, is a stunning Australian native plant known for its vibrant red flowers that bloom in spring. Here are some tips on how to grow and care for Warata. Climate and Soil Warata is native to the southeast coast of Australia and prefers a cool, moist climate. It grows best in acidic, well-drained soils with good organic matter. Light and Water Warata requires full sun to grow and thrive. It also needs consistent moisture, so make sure the soil stays moist but not waterlogged. Water deeply once or twice a week, depending on the weather and soil type. Fertilizer Warata is a light feeder, so it does not require much fertilizer. If necessary, use a slow-release, low-phosphorus fertilizer in spring or early summer. Pruning Warata does not require regular pruning, but you can remove any dead, damaged, or diseased branches. After flowering, you can also prune the plant to maintain its shape. Protection Warata is vulnerable to root rot, so make sure this oil is well drained and avoid overwatering. It is also susceptible to frost damage, so protect the plant during cold weather by covering it with a frost cloth. Propagation Warata can be propagated by seed or cuttings. Seed propagation can be challenging as the seeds require specific conditions to germinate. Cuttings should be taken from new growth in late summer or early autumn and should be dipped in rooting hormone before planting. By following these tips, you can successfully grow and care for Warata, a beautiful and iconic Australian native plant.